There are millions of games on Roblox, but in this video, I'm showing you just a hundred that you'll never get bored playing. I'm talking about games that are actually fun and will bring you genuine enjoyment. The only problem is, I've got less than 10 minutes to show all the games, so let the challenge begin. Okay, so starting off with game number one is Natural Disasters. In this game, you just gotta survive whatever Mother Nature throws at you on a small little island. The next game is Work at a Pizza Place, and its name pretty much explains Pizza. the objective. You can work as a cashier, chef, boxier, deliverer, supplier, and the manager, and earn the sweet, juicy money. And here's one of the best football games in existence. I'm not lying, people. Touch football is perfect with the boys. Speaking of the boys, here are some games that are fun to play with your friends. Like Jenga Tower, the game selects one player to launch launch massive trains towards your building and all you gotta do is survive. And this is Arsenal. The aim is to be the best shooter in the server and be the first to 32 kills to win the game. And here's Epic Minigames which provides fun and engaging minigames which is great for anyone who is new to Roblox. And this is Hide and Seek Extreme which is a simple game of hide and seek so don't get caught. Now here's a story based game called Camping and this is Shark Bite. One person is chosen to be shark and their role is to eat everyone who is human. While it's a human Human's role to survive and destroy the shark. Speaking of survival, this game allows you to climb Mount Everest, just like the real thing. And here is Plates of Mayhem. The game gives you your own plate to stay on, and your objective is to be the last plate standing. And here's Horrific Housing. This is a more chilled version of Plates of Mayhem, and you also get a house. And here's the Roblox version of Uno. This is perfect for people who love Uno and Roblox. And here's Steep Steps. The mission is to reach the top of the mountain with only a ladder, nothing else. So just make sure you don't don't drop it or you'll be stuck there. Anyway, here's Elimination Tower, a game show with a series of challenges to be the last man standing. And while we're on the topic of game shows, if you actually listened in class then you should smash this game and the best part is the host is a literal banana. And this is Speed Draw. Your aim is to make the best drawing of a chosen topic as the drawing with the highest votes will win the game. And here's Breaking, a story based game of surviving the purge and defending your friends against the bad guys who break into your house. Speaking of bad guys, the schoolhouse is a funnier replica of Baldi's basics. Just collect 10 books or you'll get spanked by a bald guy. Now in this game, you're given a wide range of classic board games like chess, checkers, connect four, knots and crosses, and much more. And while we're on board games, you can play the official Roblox version of chess. And these next games allow free private servers for just you and your friends. Like Super Golf, which I play all the time with my brothers whenever we're bored. This game is pretty much crazy golf, but 100 times better. And here's Arcade Island, a real arcade with game machines that that actually work. And if you want to try out bowling, then you can do exactly that in Roblox. bowling. Nice. Okay, so if you're watching this all alone and realize you don't have any friends, then don't worry, because here are some games that you can still have fun all by yourself. Like Silly Simon Says. This is pretty much Simon Says, but with a goofy looking Simon. And this is an infinite road trip to who knows where. And here's an iconic game show called Hole in the Wall. Your objective is to fit in a shape and avoid plunging into the cold water. And here is Ragdoll Engine. In this game, you can ragdoll on a series of obstacles which can be oddly satisfying and fun to watch. Now if you've never made a cake, you can create your very own cake and feed it to the giant noob. And here's the normal elevator. This game makes you encounter some interesting flaws, which is totally normal. And here's don't press the button. Somehow people still press the button which does make it exciting, as it leads to a series of challenges and events. And here is a unique recreation of getting over it. Your aim is to raise the ball to the top using your racks. Speaking of balls, you can ride a car as a ball. And here's would you rather. There's two options to pick and you've just got to decide what you think is the best option. And here's pick a side which is similar but instead you have to fight to the death against the opposition vote. Next up is guess the drawing. This game selects a person to draw a certain word and the rest have to guess what they're drawing. And here's survivor crushing wall. The name of the game really says it all. Okay so here are some unknown and underrated games that deserve some spotlight. Like the game lab experiment. The objective is to survive through the disasters on a small plane while the lava is rising. And here's Prilda's track and field which is great to compete against your friends to see who's the best athlete. And next up is Word Bomb. You have to come up with a word with the given letters before the bomb explodes. And here's an actual version of the game Jenga. And here is Survive the Disasters which is one of the first games I ever played. You have to survive some crazy disasters to get the juice gears and power ups. Okay now here is some destruction games that may satisfy you. Like Ship Crash Physics. You can sink ships by crashing them into rocks and it even has the Titanic. And in this game, all you do is destroy a city. And here's Destroy a Bridge. You simply destroy
destroy a bridge for your own satisfaction. Now here's Grinding Simulator. If you've ever seen those grinder videos on YouTube Shorts, then this is exactly that, except you're in control. And here's Broken Bones, which you can launch yourself off a mountain. It's kind of satisfying, but kids, don't do this at home. And here's Spray Paint, where you can test your art skills in a cool skate park. And here's Car Crushers, where there is literal rows, maybe thousands, of different ways to destroy your car. Okay, so we're now officially halfway through all the games and time is looking okay. So here's some survival based games, like Naval Warfare. This game allows you to simulate being in the army and to fight against the enemies. And here's Prison Life where you can become a cop and keep the prisoners locked up, or become a prisoner and try to escape. Now Jailbreak is the same concept but the game allows you to do more as a criminal, like robbing banks and hijacking trains. And here's Yeet a Friend where you can literally yeet your friend across the map for disrespecting your mama. And if you want to fling bigger objects in your mama, then you can do exactly that in this other game. And here's Doom Spire, a fun PvP game. The same goes for Pilfering Pirates, which is the same but with boats instead. Now while we're on PvP, you can steal time from others who step outside of the safe zone. And here's Slap Battles, where you can slap those who have wronged you. And here's our first horror based game. The aim is to collect all the cheese without the giant rat from catching you. My type of game. And here's the Tsunami game, a charging wave that's heading towards you which is kind of scary if you ask me. Now Roblox isn't complete without hobbies, so here's the best hobbies in my opinion. Starting with Tower of L, the game that started this channel. And here's Easy Fun Hobby if you want a less difficult hobby. And here's Two Players Hobby. This game is all about teamwork so it's essential that you both work together. And here is Golf Hobby, for people who love golf and hobbies. And here's the Car Hobby, it's a simple hobby but you're a big chunky car. And here's Flood Escape, you gotta finish the hobby before the water catches you. And this is an hobby but you're a potato. And here's Hook Hobby. This game is perfect for anyone who wants to swing around like Spider-Man. Now Roblox ain't all about playing but can be used to learn some important stuff. So here's some creative games that can teach you a lot of things. Like the game Bloxburg. This game's advanced building tools allows you to make some detailed houses. Like you could literally recreate your house if you tried. And even in Roller Coaster Tycoon 2, you can create your own dream park. And in this game you can even learn how to play the piano. Now if you want to build a boat for treasure, then you can do exactly that in this game. And in this game, you can build your own car, plane, boat, and combine them all into something greater. And here's Lumber Tycoon, which teaches you the arts of gathering wood and utilizing it for a better thing. Speaking of wood, here's a trivia game show, which is similar to Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? And here is Mini City. In this game, you can create your own civilization in the palm of your hands. And this is my movie, which allows you to create your own movie from scratch and then show it to the entire server. Now if you're the type of person who likes exploring, here are some games that are made for pure adventure and experience. Like someone who literally recreated the Universal theme park into Roblox. But if you're more of a Disney fan, then there's a recreation of the entire Disney theme park. While we're on theme parks, Roblox Point is a classic theme park on Roblox with its own unique roller coasters. And here's the Roblox water park, with water slides that go straight to the sky. Speaking of water, you can experience the sinking of the Titanic and choose the role of a captain, a crew member, or a passenger. But if you're hungry, you can experience a Korean restaurant. But if you're really hungry, you can eat a giant waffle along with others. Okay, so after eating that waffle, I need a number two. So here's Public Bathroom Simulator. So guys, give me some privacy, guys. Like, please. Okay, so going back to if you have no friends, here are some games where you can make some new friends. Like, please donate. If someone is kind enough, they can donate you some real Robux to you. And if you want to test how good your avatar is, then play Rate My Avatar. And here's Roblox Got Talent, a recreation of the famous TV show, and linking to that is Fashion Famous. Your objective is to make the best outfit in the set time to try and impress the judges with the highest vote. And if you want to test your rapping skills, then you and one other person will spit nothing but bars and the audience will decide who stays on stage. Now here is VR hands. People with VR headsets can control players who don't and put them in the palm of their hand. Okay people, the home straight is here. So let's finish these final 10 games with the best simulators and tycoon games. Like Restaurant Tycoon. If you've ever wanted to build your own 5 star restaurant then this game is perfect.
it. And here's Resort Tycoon if you want to flex on the haters with your mansions. Same for if you want to build your own shopping mall, and if you want to build your own retail park, but if you want to be like me and become a YouTuber, then this game allows you to fully experience what I have to do, except all the hard work and struggles that is needed. Now if you want to dig for treasure, you can do that in Treasure Hunt Simulator, and here's Car Crash Simulator, but here's Blast Off Simulator, where you can literally blast off rockets into space. Watch out Elon Musk, and here's Singer Tycoon, which allows you to build your path to become a famous pop star and build a worldwide audience. And for our final game, we have Beat Up Simulator. This game allows you to spawn in any Roblox player and beat them up in many different ways. Well, well it looks like we've managed to mention all 100 games. We did it folks. Now that you know this video exists, I hope that you'll never get bored playing Roblox. So enjoy playing folks.